The time has arrived. We are in March. The tulips are coming back up in the garden. Spring cleaning time is here and I am so here for it. I love a spring clean. I love an excuse to do a really big declutter and clean all of the areas I usually forget. But if you're anything like me and you have kids, you work and you don't have like a long period of time just in one go, then you need to break it down into two parts as I always do. So today I'm going to be completely tidying and cleaning as if like I was putting my house in the state that I like it to be in. Because let's be honest, if you have kids and a husband, when you clean, the next day it's a mess. So I'm going to be cleaning the house today and having it as I would like it if, for example, I would have people over. And then tomorrow, before it gets trashed, I am going to be doing my spring cleaning. So I'm going to be decluttering everywhere. I'm going to be cleaning places I never normally clean. I'm going to be doing all of the spring cleaning things. But there is no point in me undertaking that today when it's going to take me a few hours just to get the house in a state ready for a spring clean. So today we are cleaning the house, tomorrow we are spring cleaning. I am back with the trusty sip cream and that is because the pink stuff cream like it just leaves creamy smears everywhere. I'm looking here because my cooker was left with creamy smears. Luckily my cupboards are white because they had creamy smears all over them. It just doesn't work in as well as sip. So I'm back on the sip and I'm just so happy about it. I mean it's no surprise that I'm loving a Sephora product but I am absolutely loving Linen Fresh at the moment. I have just started it as you can see and I absolutely love the scent so I'm going to go in with that on top just to shine it up a bit and make it smell lovely. So I use exactly the same products on the sink as I do on the hob so I'm going to get out my sieve cream and my Sephora again and deep clean the sink. surfaces in the kitchen a wipe down including the cupboards the fridge etc now i am so buzzing let me tell you tomorrow to like clean skirting boards when i do my spring clean i'm like really eager to do it now but i'm thinking no i need to get the whole house in a reasonable state so that i can have a really good old spring clean tomorrow but i can't tell you the urge i'm getting to like scrub the grid along the hob or to wipe down the doors and the handles which i rarely do i'll be honest because I've got like, I'm just so eager to do a spring clean. But today I need to make sure I just get the whole house <laughs> in a position to be able to spring clean. So I'm just going to carry on with my usual routine. And I'm going to wipe down the covers of the surfaces, wipe down the bin. But best believe tomorrow the bin is getting empty. The bottom is getting scrubbed. The doors are getting cleaned. On top of the cupboards is getting cleaned. Because it is hella greasy up there. And I'm just so excited. But I need to hold out until tomorrow.
like to use wipes on the bin and that's because I don't really like my microfiber cloth going on the bin and all the germs. I know that I do put them in the washing machines but I often use obviously the same microfiber cloth for something else. Um, I don't just use like one to clean each thing. Um, so I just don't want to transfer any of those germs along. So I use a wipe and then just pop it in the bin. I also really enjoy using a bin body spray and that's just to freshen up the bags. These are brand new bags, but I will just give them a little spray just so they stay smelling lovely. Okay, so these two rooms are clean. That art trolley is getting tackled in the spring clean. That I cannot wait to get into with a nice big bin bag um, because that is overflowing and a mess. And then the kitchen is also clean and tidy. The floors have been hoovered and mopped as you've seen. I'm now going to move into the hallway. So in here we are going with a good old hoover and mop. Okay, so next I'm going to be heading into the downstairs toilet and I am going to be using my elbow grease bathroom mousse to clean up the toilet and sink with two minkies, uh, minkies? Are these minkies? Yeah. Two minkies as usual, one for the sink, one for the toilet. And I'm going to be going in with my new favourite Garden Escape Duck Toilet Gel. It's a really nice lime green colour and smells lovely, not that I should be smelling in the fumes. And then I'm going to clean the mirror with, of course, the Astonish Window and Glass Cleaner in Eucalyptus and Lemon, which is brilliant. <laughs> least today before the big old spring clean tomorrow I'm just gonna freshen up the sofas with some fabric freshener 
and hoover the floor and mop the floor. Um, it's pretty tidy-ish kind of already. So I'm just gonna give it that last little push. And then we are ready for a real good old spring clean tomorrow, which I am buzzing about. is me done and ready to tackle the good stuff tomorrow i am so excited to start spring cleaning tomorrow i'm gonna do things that i never normally do um, in my videos and i'm super super excited as it only comes around once a year really where i do this massive blow attack at it and yeah i hope you've all enjoyed my precursor to a spring clean and i will see you all in my next video with a part one um, I hope I've given you some motivation today and I will see you all soon. Bye!